it's Gary here, and welcome to episode 2 of my Let's Play of East Origin on the PC. I have been, it's been a little while since I filmed the pilot for this, but I'm just going to pick up where I left off. So, apologies I'm a little bit rusty with the controls. Um, basically, Unica got teleported into this room at the end of the last episode, and managed to reclaim a goddess statue, essentially. Um, Shulk, can I get a divine blessing? No, probably don't want to do that yet. Um, oh, I could. Let's just look at it again. I thought I, had, I was reading the wrong one. I could strengthen my current armour a little bit. That might be good. Um, we'll do that. Yeah, let's go for that. So, Cool. Sweet, sweet prayers. And now, I'm minimally exceptional. That's more than I hoped for when I woke up this morning. So... What I'm going to do is just have a look around, see what's to do. Um, it looks like there's a way out here. Is there anything we can do with this? There's a peculiarly shaped depression in the altar. Hmm. I'm sure there's something that's going to fit into that. Do I have anything that will... That's not the right... No. Ah. Controls. Um, inventory. No, I don't have anything that looks like it's going to fit. But I do have a little... I could go and... Let's try this. So I've got Olia's voice. Um, yeah, it's peachy. You know, apart from being trapped in a room. Yeah. Well, yeah. Okay. I might as well. Yeah, I might as well keep running around. Although I've just used... Ah, oh, the same message. That's the same message again, Gary, come on. Right, um, so if I make my way... Can I go out the other end then, out the front? Yes, I can. So... Hmm. Oh, ah, there's one there. I didn't see him, but I managed to jump on him quite effectively. And my fighting skills are a little bit rusty here, but I think I should just be able to take them out. Let me do a bit of that. I seem to work quite well, apart from the fact that something just reappeared there. But it's dead again, so cool. Got a bit of a boost going here as well, if I can keep it up. Um, but so let's just go. Are they like likes or something like that? Or liches, so to say. Um, I've always called them that since I first read, like, read it in a book, basically, I haven't heard it said. Um, but so I'll just do some slaughtering, basically. Oh, watch out for that, whatever that is. D Death discs, like some sort of Dragon Ball type affair. And just, yep, jump over the top of that. Sweet. Right. Um, I don't know exactly where I'm going or what I'm doing, but I'm doing it pretty well, it seems, so I'm going to keep doing it, just keep hammering these things. There we go, another level as well. Um, so 80 HP, mm, not bad, not bad. Maximum strength armor, which is obviously doing us some good. And right, so we've got these fellas here. Oh, and someone else as well. So, let me just get out the way of that. And I don't tack these things too much. There we go. Just have to get the right angle, I guess. Collect all these bits of... I'm not even 100% sure what they are, to be honest. Bits and pieces of stuff, though. Um, get one of these. Beat it to a pulp. There we go. Yeah, you stay dead. Um, ah, take him out before you got a chance to do anything. And what this? See if I can get. Ah. Oh, nasty. Double nasty. Ow. Oh. Ow. Okay, that was bad. Taking a bit of damage here, but I should be okay. I just need to stay on my toes a little bit. Get the angles right. There we go. Get some nice stuff there. Ah, and health regeneration. Sweet, sweet health regeneration. I'll say sweet, sweet mana, but it isn't that. It's the other one. Um, right, and, yeah, just massacre him a bit. Sweet. So, is that... Am I supposed to be able to jump off top of here? It's looking like I should, but I have not got... I haven't got the game yet. Uh, maybe there's a skill I need to get double jump or something like that. Let's have a look. I'll probably get across this way, actually. Or get up here, at the very least. 
take this one out. I'm trying to get hurt too much. There we go. Collect some bits and bobs. Now, this was a little bit my downfall in the last episode of Memory Serves, so let's see if I can just do some half decent jumping across things. But I'm not going to be able to make it all the way across the armor. No. Kind of guessed that, but no. Nah. Right. Let's try going the other way along there then. See if there's anything else. But okay, if I can do it in, without falling over. No? Oh, come on. Sort yourself out, Unica. There we go. Right, and just have a bit of that. Oh. There we go. Aha! So finish killing that. That'll do. Oh, nearly. There we go. Right. Now we have something to aim towards. So there we go. We're getting the hang of the jumping as well. So just one over there, one over there. And we have a road of... Ooh! Ah, uh, it's been a while since I've heard that music. Happier times. So... Ah, oh, I keep pressing up to go to the menu. It's not the menu, is it? I keep wasting my, like, boost on just stupidity. Oh well. Um, yeah, delicious fruit from one of the two rhoda trees. Favourite food of sacred animals known as ruse. Well, we know all about them as well. So, yeah, let's, well, guess we keep going. Just try not to... Check hope I do run into something while I've still got this going. Come on. There we go. This is the way I just came in. Looks a little bit familiar. Um, but never mind, we'll work it out. No, it's not, is it? I'm expecting someone else to... There we go. It's been too long without one of these things appearing, so... They get murked. Um, he's a long way up the air. Get back down. There we go. And, yep, yeah, a bit more of that. Come on then, guys. You can't just stand there and expect me to take it. So, one more of them. Before it attacks again. Clean up the goods. And in there. That'll do me. Right, so what have we got here? That looks like... Yeah, it's fairly shut. There doesn't appear to be any sort of keyhole. Right, so I'm guessing I've got to go the other way. And hopefully we'll have another sort of trip switch or something like that. I see a little bit of defence bonus there as well, though hopefully I won't be needing too much of it. He said, as he just got hit. Um, several times, probably. And just take these out. There we go. I'll teach you to get in my way. There we go. A bit of healing. Bits and pieces of... Is that SP? Should really be watching. Um... Right. Oop, and there's another warrior type. Oop, ow, I just got hit as well. Silly, silly, silly me. Um, right. Right, avoid the destructo. Oh, what was that? Okay. I'll deal with that in a second, I guess. Oh, ow. So I'll come out of the way. Um, same with that one. Damn it, stop sucking. Right, if I can get this one taken down. There we go. Right, let's see. So, I'm just checking to the pet. Oh, I fired into it too quickly. I think that's what that is. Ooh, nice. I want one of those from the house. Um, level up, right. So, the purple stuff. If I walk into that, yeah, that's my SP. Um, and I have a box with an emerald in. Sweet. I can get some mad loot with that. Oh. Whirlwind power increased. That'll do me. So, ah, jewels unlock the full potential of the artifacts of Ace. So, the specific jewels associated with each of the three artifacts. With each jewel acquired, the corresponding skill becomes more powerful. Emerald being wind, topaz being thunder, and ruby being fire. Even with the single jewel collected, the appropriate skill can now be charged. So, even with a single jewel collected, the appropriate skill can now be charged. Additional jewels increase the rate of MP recovery. And provide an overall increase in power. So basically, Whirlwind's going to start getting awesome. So I can do that, hold it down. Get kind of a bit, bit floaty, I guess. Um, 
Yeah, unlock that. And I'm just, there we go. Nice big for all time's sake. Um whirlwind. So didn't leave anything up here, I'm just checking why I'm going back, so hopefully it's gonna be a quiet run back since I already murdered everything along here. With my with my axe. No. Right. So let's have a look, see what's through this door we've unlocked. Ooh, outside. And we are... It doesn't look overly nice. Um, No. No, let's get back inside. Um, So, yeah. <laughs> Lovely weather for a run. Hopefully, this is our... There we go. Blue Moon Crest. Right. Mysterious voice, eh? That looks familiar. Is that a Rue by any chance? What? what, what? If you're a demon, then why don't I feel threatened by you? You're actually just cute. So cute. Yeah. Ah, good, yeah. Vapors outside transformed into demons, but demon or no, you're just too, too cute. Uh, please don't eat my face. Um, yeah, I'm not getting it. There's a lot of vowel, so you constant looking things in there. Not a lot of vowels. Um, yeah. If someone from House Gemma were here, to be able to communicate, but I wouldn't even know where to begin. You make a valid point, but uh, yeah, that's. Oh, there's a question in there, at least. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just hit things. Or chop things. Yeah, it's a proud legacy, but not one of understanding demons, so... Oh. It's getting mad. Are you hungry? Right. It's a growl of a stomach. I think so. Uh, can I have some cake? Basically, that is in Rue. I want cake! It's cake dance. Yeah. See, we can communicate just fine. Well, it goes against my basic instincts to, to give away food, but let's do it. Make a friend, hopefully. Yay, heart. So... Yeah, still don't know what you're getting at, but... Whoa! It, did it just cough up a piece of Clarion ore? And put it in my inventory? And strengthen my axe with it? Even better! Awesome! Now my axe is mighty, and shall so slay all beasts in front of it. Yeah. Yeah, they're pretty good, but... I guess. This is, I, I wonder if you can play it through again and understand what the hell it's saying, because clearly having a conversation with you. But yes, thank you for helping me destroy things. So I shouldn't start talking to it again and just be like, nah. Right. Oh, well, that was um, fruitful. Pardon the pun. Um, right. What I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try and keep these episodes a bit shorter than I've been doing them. Aiming around like sort of the 10 15 minute mark. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap it up here for the video and I will meet you back at the start of the next episode um, up where the where there's the altar with the indentation in it because oh, I assume that that's where we will pick up. So, um, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Um, please let me know if you what you think. Um, basically about the, the shorter times or not I, th I think it might make them a bit more sort of palatable and I can get more done basically in a sitting which obviously is good for me as well um, but yeah um, in the meantime thank you very much for watching and have a good day bye